Hi everyone, it's Fia, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to upload your own 3D models into VirtualCast. Hey! This works for models, props, environments, but I'm going to focus mostly on the model aspect since that is the most important part of VTubing. <laughs> Hopefully you followed along my getting started tutorial and already have your Seed Online account set up in the Google Translate function set to English. So go ahead and log into your account and you can see up in the search bar, you can actually look through other people's items and other people's models, but you can also upload them yourself. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab a VRM model that I made in Vroid Studio up over into this spot right here. All right, now that I've uploaded this model into one of my 30 slots, it's connected to my Seed Online account, which means that I can use it in any Seed Online compatible apps, including VirtualCast, yay! All right, and if you wanna check your imports for whatever reason, then you can go ahead and click on your profile picture on the top right corner, and this is gonna show you all of the items that you have loaded in game. And as you can see, I have my new character model right here. Alright, so now that we've loaded into the game here, I can go ahead and bring open my menu settings and hit character change. And now we're going to see the models right here. Alright, so now you can see I've loaded in as my new character model. And if I go ahead and open up the um, menu here, you can see I have all of my custom items that I might have imported. And then I also have my special backgrounds that I've imported. So that's how you get everything. Um, into virtual cast. As you can see, there are tons of great customization options that come in all shapes and forms through virtual cast. And it's a lot easier to use and understand than most other game engines that do similar things. I think if you've got a group of people together with all the needed skills that you could make some really cool content or events just using virtual cast if you create your own environments or items. Anyways, if you like this video, then please subscribe to the Virtual Reality Show channel for more virtual cast and VTuber related content. And make sure to check out the last episode of the show where we talk about the history of Oculus. If you want to talk more about virtual cast or other topics related to virtual reality, then please consider joining my Discord, link in the description. I'm currently saving up for full body tracking, so if you want to support the Virtual Reality Show, please consider donating or subscribing to my Patreon. It really helps me make my videos better. Anyways, thanks for watching. My name is Fia, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye!